hey guys welcome back to my channel so today i look is featuring the most popular palette which is the amrezy palette i created this beautiful eye look using the amrezy palette today and i want to share with you guys how i came up with this look featuring warm browns purples and a little bit of glitter as well so i hope you guys enjoy this tutorial So I already did my brows, I filled them in using my Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Pro Palette and I used the shade Soft Brown with my Brow is Brow Pencil and both are from Anastasia Beverly Hills. I put a link to the video below to show you guys how I do my brows. So the palette I'm using is the Amrezy Palette and these are some gorgeous colours if you want to go from neutral to glam. The first shade I'm using is called Caramel which is a beautiful transition shade. It's just a really beautiful warm brown. I'm just going to go ahead and apply it to my crease using a MAC 224 brush which I had for literally 10 years if you can see the the um the handle started to like fall off but it's still good so this is a MAC 224 brush that I'm just using to apply the color all over my lid next I'm taking the next shade which is called Morocco which is a warm reddish brown and I'm just gonna go ahead and use the same 224 brush and just apply that to my um, my crease as well using windshield wiper motion this is going to create a beautiful transition and I always use at least one or two color that's warm and just to kind of help to give me a little bit more depth in my crease and create a beautiful gradient effect taking this matte 217 blender brush it's a little bit more dense and I'm going to take up the next color called deep plum which is a beautiful color and I'm going to take a little bit and define my crease area as you can see I really don't have such a different crease so I'm literally wedging the brush in my socket so this way I can create that outline of a cut crease and I love love that deep plum color it's so so pretty so again I'm just working it into the crease just to create an outline then I'm going to go back with my 224 brush and I'm just going to take the same color called caramel and just to blend out any harsh edges So as a brow bone highlight, I'm taking this color called Cream from my Lavish palette from Anastasia Beverly Hills. I absolutely love this as a highlight color. It's matte, no shimmer, and it's just a beautiful tone on my skin. I love it. So I'm just taking it on a double-ended brush from Tarte. I'm just go ahead and fluff that underneath the highest part of my arch, and then feather down the rest into the eyeshadow. So it creates a beautiful gradient smoky look i really really love this um eyeshadow next i'm taking a definer blender brush with lbd which is a dark black color i'm just applying that to my crease and really really carving out the crease area avoiding the color avoiding getting color on the lid i'm trying to go for more like a cut crease so i'm just definitely taking my time with this blending out as i go along and following my natural crease space and just really lifting my brush a little bit higher to kind of lift my eyes a little bit so as you can see i created like an outer v and then just take my blush brush and just kind of blend it in so it gives me more of like a cut crease effect so hope that makes sense so i'm just taking a little bit on my brush wedge it in my crease and working my way up and out as i go along and this will kind of give me like a really nice defined cut crease the next color i'm taking is the same lbd i'm going to take a little bit on this mac brush it's like a synthetic um shader brush i'm gonna go underneath my lower lash line and I'm just going to go ahead and smoke that out. I'm just taking a little bit at a time and really work it in close to my lash line area. So next I'm taking my NYX Jumbo Pencil that I departed in Milk and I'm applying that to the rest of my eyelid area. And this is just prepping for the next um, eye color that I'm going to put on which I wanted to be a little bit more brighter. So I use this as a base and I'm using a MAC Synthetic Brush along with that. Next I'm taking my pigment and this is one of the Stila Press um, glitter pigments, it's absolutely gorgeous. I got a sample from work so I'm just testing it out today. I'll put the name of it down in the bottom bar. So I took a little bit up on my finger and I'm just rubbing it right on top of that NYX Jumbo Pencil. I'm telling you guys this stuff is super glittery, a little bit goes a long way, super super glittery but I really really love it. So next I'm taking that color called Iridescent Purple, I'm just going to add it in the inner 
um, corner of my eye just for a pop of color. I thought it was cute when I applied it there. And yeah, just to kind of, you know, jazz up my look a little bit. So you can totally skip this, but I thought it was really cool. So I applied that to my inner um, lid area. And I'm using the MAC 224 blender brush again. I think that's the MAC one, I'm not quite sure. <laughs> Next, I'm going to line my eyes using this, a new liner. This is a Kat Von D liquid eyeliner. I, I ran out of my Stila, but this one works just as well. And I really, really love a felt tip pen and this one doing the job really really nicely so I'm just gonna go ahead and line my eyes and apply some photos lashes today to my look and this one is just random and beauty supplies to lashes no brand at all just like $1.99 and they work really really well with this look so I already applied my foundation and blusher and just to save time because I'm always rushing to work this is what I'm gonna be wearing on my lips today is bright and bold this is the Kat Von D love lipstick but because I'm taking a train I'm gonna be wearing a nude lipstick today just to kind of tone everything down because at work I have more fun with playing with different color lipstick but this is it overall I really do like the eyes very nice and traumatic and I use my Amrezy palette which I'm absolutely loving right now. Wait, my camera is picking up a little bit yellow because of the light in right now. But anyways, this is it. I hope you guys enjoyed the look. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. And I will show you guys pictures later. So I hope you guys have a nice day. Bye.